Have you ever wondered if the secret to unlocking a healthier, more vibrant life could lie in the balance of your meals and not just their nutritional content? I'm diving deep into a topic that stirred quite the buzz in the wellness world, the alkaline diet. Together, we're going to explore this fascinating approach to eating, where the focus isn't just on what we eat, but on how the foods we choose impact our body's pH levels. We'll uncover the science behind it, sift through the claims, and even tackle some controversies. I've heard some people say it's all just a myth. Well, we're about to find out. So let's embark on this intriguing journey to discover if the alkaline diet could be the golden key to health we've all been searching for, or if it's just another fad fading into the nutrition black hole. All right, let's get into what the alkaline diet really is because trust me, it's not just about eating your greens and calling it a day. The alkaline diet, sometimes known as the acid alkaline diet or the alkaline ash diet, is like your body's personal interior designer, focusing on sprucing up the place by tweaking the pH levels. Now, if you're wondering what pH levels have got to do with anything, they're actually a big deal when it comes to our health. You can think of pH as a scale that measures how acidic or alkaline something is, on a scale from 0 to 14, water, for instance, is neutral at a pH of 7. Anything below 7 is considered acidic, while anything above 7 is alkaline. Our bodies are all about balance, especially when it comes to pH levels. Different parts of our body have different optimal pH ranges. For example, our stomach is naturally acidic, which helps with digestion, while our blood is slightly alkaline, with a tight pH range between 7.35 and 7.45. Maintaining these pH levels is crucial for these several reasons. First is enzyme function. Many enzymes that drive biochemical reactions in our body work best at specific pH levels. If the pH is off, enzymes can slow down or stop working, which can mess with everything from digestion to energy production. Next is nutrient absorption. The pH level affects the body's ability to absorb nutrients from the food we eat. For instance, an alkaline environment in the small intestine helps with the absorption of vitamins and minerals. Then we have detoxification. The body's ability to detoxify itself, neutralizing and eliminating toxins, depends partly on maintaining the right pH balance. It also helps with immune system support. Proper pH levels help the immune system function correctly. An imbalanced pH level can make the body more susceptible to diseases. And of course, it's great for overall health. When the body's pH levels are out of balance, it can lead to various health issues. For example, if the blood becomes too acidic, a condition known as acidosis, it can lead to fatigue, shortness of breath, and even severe health conditions if not corrected. Our bodies are pretty good at regulating pH levels through mechanisms like breathing and kidney function, but our lifestyle and diet choices can influence our internal pH balance. So the idea here is pretty straightforward. By loading up on foods that promote a more alkaline environment within our bodies and cutting back on those that create an acidic vibe, we could potentially turn our internal health scene from a chaotic punk rock concert to a serene, harmonious symphony. We're talking about a diet that works perfectly with the goodness of fruits, veggies, nuts, and legumes, while giving the cold shoulder to meat, poultry, fish, dairy, grains, and, yep, those ever-tempting processed foods. Now why would anyone want to cut out all that good stuff? Well, proponents of the alkaline diet believe this shift not only plays with our pH levels, but also drops the ball on the risk of chronic diseases and ailments. Imagine that your food choices could be the hidden heroes in your body's epic journey against health villains. And it's not just about what you're adding to your plate, it's about creating a balance that sings in harmony with your body's needs. So as we explore further, let's keep an open mind and see if this diet hits the right notes for a healthier lifestyle. All right, let's break down these potential perks of the alkaline diet in the most simple way. First up, improve bone health. Imagine your bones like the framework of a building. Just like you'd want that building to be made of the strongest steel, you want your bones to be as sturdy as possible. The alkaline diet is like the construction crew that comes in, making sure your bones are built with the best materials around by encouraging foods that are rich in minerals. Next, we're talking about reducing muscle wasting. Think of your muscles like the engine of a car. You want that engine running smoothly and efficiently, right? Muscle wasting is like having that engine start to sputter and stall. By focusing on alkaline foods, the diet aims to keep the engine, that is your muscles, purring like a kitten, especially as you age. On to magnesium levels. This mineral is like the oil that keeps that engine lubricated. It's crucial for over 300 enzyme reactions in your body, 
from making DNA to helping your muscles contract. Many of us don't get enough magnesium, but the alkaline diet puts it in the spotlight, ensuring your body's machinery runs smoothly. Now, let's talk about your heart and brain, your body's headquarters. The alkaline diet promotes cardiovascular health and cognitive function. Imagine your heart as the CEO of a bustling company and your brain as the genius behind all the operations. This diet aims to keep the CEO and the genius in tip-top shape, ensuring the whole system thrives. And who doesn't love a good weight loss story? Some people on the alkaline diet find that shedding pounds is easier than on other diets. It's like finally finding the right key to unlock a door that's been stuck for ages. Lastly, but definitely not least, the really big one. Reduce the risk of chronic diseases, such as arthritis and cancer. This is like having a top-notch security system for your body, keeping unwelcome guests at bay. While the full protective effects of the alkaline diet are still under investigation, many believe that creating a more alkaline environment in the body can tremendously help to ward off these unwelcome health intruders. Now let's get into the science claims behind the alkaline diet and why it's like that one friend who swears they've seen a unicorn. You want to believe them, but you need a bit more to go on. The alkaline diet has been making waves, claiming it can do everything from strengthening your bones to reducing your risk of cancer. Sounds incredible, right? But here's where the plot thickens. The scientific community has been giving this diet the side eye, demanding more proof before jumping on the bandwagon. First off, our bodies are like expert pH balancers. Think of them as tightrope walkers at the circus, effortlessly maintaining balance. This natural regulation means that no matter if you eat a lemon or some lettuce, your body works hard to keep your pH levels steady. Scientists argue that because of this, the impact of our diet on our body's pH is more of a splash in the ocean than a tsunami of change. Then there's the issue of evidence, or rather, the lack of it. The alkaline diet presents a case with some pretty big claims, like boosting bone health and fighting off cancer. But when you start digging for concrete evidence, the trail goes cold. Most research hasn't been able to draw a direct line between munching on alkaline foods and scoring those health benefits. For example, our bones are often brought into the spotlight with claims that the alkaline diet can make them stronger. Yet when scientists put their detective hats on, they haven't found solid proof to back up these claims. And about reducing cancer risk? Again, the evidence is as elusive as a whisper in the wind. The scientific community calls for more research, more data, and more robust findings before declaring the alkaline diet a winner in the fight against cancer. So, as we navigate the vast sea of nutrition advice, keeping an inquisitive mind and a healthy dose of skepticism might just be our best compass. Now let's get into the fun part. What kind of foods can we eat while on the diet that give us the most alkaline effects on our body? I'll start with some of the most popular foods and then get into which ones have the most protein. Leafy greens like kale, spinach, Swiss chard, and arugula add plenty of vitamins and minerals. Cucumbers, which are high in alkaline and very hydrating. Avocados, they're great for your heart, loaded with good fats. Almonds, they are alkaline forming but also packed with protein and healthy fats and easy to take on the go. Quinoa is a complete protein, boasting all nine essential amino acids. Lemons or lemon water taste acidic but they're actually alkaline forming in the body. Sweet potatoes, great source of fiber, vitamins, and minerals. Berries, also high in antioxidants. Watermelon, very hydrating. And herbal teas. Swap out your coffee for herbal teas like ginger, peppermint, or chamomile. Now I want to give you the top 10 alkaline foods that are highest in protein because we all need a good protein source. We have quinoa, almonds and almond butter, chia seeds, lentils and legumes, tofu and tempeh, green peas, hemp seeds, spirulina, pumpkin seeds, and sprouted grain bread. Incorporating these top alkaline foods and protein sources into your alkaline diet ensures you're not only supporting your body's pH balance, but also getting the building blocks needed for repair, growth, and overall health. And with a little creativity, you can enjoy a diverse protein-rich diet that's both delicious and alkaline-friendly. Thank you for hanging out with me and nerding out on some more health and nutrition topics that keep arising. I hope you gained some good knowledge here. Don't forget to subscribe for more content. And remember to keep on flexing all this new knowledge and glowing with the results. Catch you next time.